welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Marilyn and if you're not new welcome back so today I'm going to be doing an eye look with a Violet Boss Essentials 2 palette and this is what the color story looks like it's so pretty and I already accidentally scratched the brown one but it's okay because I'm not a big fan of the brown anyways <laughs> and you know what I'm just going to do a palette bingo because I can't decide what colors to use that's one of the reasons why I always do palette bingos because all the colors are so pretty and I just can't decide so I just let the random number generator decide for me <laughs> okay so I'm going to generate five shades from this palette and this palette has ten shades so here we go I got nine one six okay let's get the next two three and six again one again four so three and four okay so I got nine which is called the blue sky I got one and it's called beige and six is wild orchid you can't really see that brown one right there okay three is rose gold and four is a chocolate brown so here is the color story I have to work with today. Before I begin this eye look, I'm going to be priming my eyes with a NYX pigment primer. And I will be doing this off camera and then I'll be right back. Okay you guys, I'm back. I already primed my eyes but I have not set them because I'm going to be using that shade beige. Which is the second shade that I got. This one right there. And hopefully it's not too dark. But we will see. You can't really see, it's like the color of my skin. So I'm going to start off with Blue Sky, which is this one right here. And I'm going to be putting that one on my crease. I'm going back into that brush that I use that beige shade and I'm just going to blend out the edges I'm going back with a blue just to just to make the blue look brighter again because I blended out too much I feel like that beige made the blue look kind of green up here just kind of weird okay so I'm going into the chocolate brown and I'm just going to put a little bit on my outer V just to darken the look hopefully I don't mess it up okay before I do that actually I'm just going to put the wild orchid all over my lid and I'm going to see how I like that without the brown. I think I'm going to put some NYX glitter primer because the pink does have a little bit of shimmers. Okay, now I'm going into the pink, the Wild Orchid. Ooh, that's really pretty. Look at that. Holy crap, that's bright. Okay, now that the pink and blue mix together, it looks purple and it looks super pretty. So, I don't know, maybe I'm not going to put the brown on my outer, on my outer V. Oh my gosh, I love this pink. I think this is one of my favorite pinks I've ever tried in my life. It looks so pretty. I'm glad I didn't put the brown right here. Okay, so now I'm going to be using the brown and I'm going to put it on my lower lash line. Okay, 
Okay, I'm going back into that beige, the light brown, and I'm going to go under here. Okay, now I'm going to be doing the same thing on this eye. Okay, so now I'm going to be using this last shade right here, which is shade number three, and it is the rose gold. And I'm going to be putting that in my inner corner, and I am going to wet my brush so I could look brighter. Okay, now I'm going to apply eyeliner and mascara, and then I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, I'm back. I already applied eyeliner and mascara, and I did change my lipstick. I had like a reddish, pinkish lipstick, and I removed it, and I used a Kitty lipstick by Bare Minerals. It's like a nude lipstick. This is what it looks like. Here, I swatched it right here. This like nude pink. And on top of that, I am using a, a NYX lip gloss. The hashtag this is everything lip gloss. And this one I got in my Walmart beauty box. And then for my waterline, I am using the LA Girl Shockwave Neon Eyeliner in the shade Vivid, this purple one right here. And once again, you can't really see it. I swatched it, it's right here. And it's like a darker purple, so maybe that's why you can't really see it. For my top liner, I am using the Hank and Henry Blickety Black Liner. And then for mascara, I am using I am using an eyelash primer, the L'Oreal Voluminous Primer. This one right here. And I'm just using this to make it thicker. I mean, it makes my lashes long too, but I mainly use it to make them thicker. And then for mascara, I use the Hourglass Unlocked Instant Extension Mascara. So anyways, this is the final look. I really like how this looks. It looks super pretty. I love how it turned purple once it touched the blue and I think that's really cool. I just don't think the blue looks blue. I feel like it kind of looks green. But I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of this look? Do you guys like it? I feel like it matches because it's like a gradient from like green to like bluish to purple and then that pink. And I just really like how this turned out and I really like my inner corner. It's that rose gold. It kind of looks red, but I don't know. So anyways, let me know if you guys have this eyeshadow palette and what do you guys think of it. So far, I really like it. I'm super happy that I got this eyeshadow palette and my boxy charm, and I can't wait to play with it again. Anyways, that is all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake